mentioned the word guardrail. I think that there's two ways to look at governance, especially for AI. There's guardrails and then there's tracks. So guardrails are more like soft governance. Like this is, this is the general direction. You can, you're in control of your own vehicle. Just don't drive off the curb. Don't drive off the cliff. And then there's tracks. This is the specific route you will take. You cannot deviate from it. If the track doesn't go there, you can't go there. So what's, what do you think is the best way to do this? Are we looking at hard governance? Or are we looking at soft governance? What's the best path forward? Well, to be clear, this is the Chris opinion, not necessarily the NVIDIA opinion, because I don't, I don't know what they're thinking uh, at the top. But uh, I, I think for businesses at the moment, guardrails off paths are going to be your best bet. You can't really predict what exactly what the regulatory environment is going to look like. So being able to just say, all right, we believe that this is going to be the safest and most reasonable way to, to guide the development of whatever model it is that we're building, the guardrails that we're putting on effectively is a mini LLM that operates on top of, of whatever model it is that you're using and says like, oh, I can't talk about that financial information. I can't talk about that health information. I can't talk about that personal information. So it, it just like brings it back in without, without saying like, this is kind of a, a hard path and the only thing that I can do. It's like, well, note the things that it can't do. And it, it kind of like, you know, like in bowling, like, well, it bounces around and it gets to the, the end point eventually if you've got those like kitty rails on the, yeah. on the two sides. Uh, for businesses, trying to predict the future is a fool's errand. So trying to say, all right, well, we're going to be reasonable and operate within this framework where I know it's going down this general path. I'm going to try and be safe towards it. I'm going to, I'm going to put on guardrails as opposed to being like, this is exactly what the model will have to look like based on whatever the EU or the US or individual states do is probably a, a safer bet because you can also update those guardrails after those hard limitations come in to be able to be like, okay, now we, we understand what the regulatory framework looks like. And so we'll, we'll adjust to that.